Today has been busy. So yesterday, all day yesterday, we were setting up the computers. Um, so I set up my new computer and then I formatted Chan, my old computer, which is now becoming Chanda's computer. And then this morning we woke up and Chanda's computer would not turn on. It was doing this like BIOS loop where every time you would turn it on, it would show the BIOS screen and then shut off and, and it would say something about dual BIOS and then it would reboot and do it over and over and over. So then I Googled it and people were saying that the BIOS was corrupted so there was a way to like hold down the power button and shut off the power and do some special thing where it restores from a backup. So then that worked, but then it wouldn't boot into Windows. So then we pretty much had to reformat her computer again and I installed Windows on a different SSD drive and now that's all working. And then once we got that booted up and all installed, uh, for some reason, the USB 3.1 part that was driving the RAID dual SSD drives on her computer wasn't working. So, so I took the one out of my new computer and I put it in her computer and I took the one from her computer and put it in my computer. And uh, where are we going? Food. We're eating and then we're going to go to the 18th point. Okay. So then um, I took... Uh, so then hers started working. So now Shanna's computer's done. We're ready to go on that one. Um, I still can't get the Black Hawk or Black something or whatever the USB name of the drive was on my computer working. So whatever. Um, and now we're trying to consolidate all of our past data because we have like two 8 terabyte drives just full of stuff from years and years and years of stuff. I mean, we're saving raw files from photo shoots back in 2012. And it's like, why are we keeping all this stuff? And then when we export as JPEGs to give to the client, we usually make a zip file. So we also have all the JPEGs and we have the zip file. So we now need to go through and figure out what we can delete, what we can't delete. We're trying to consolidate all of our data into a, a nice single spot instead of things spread across multiple drives. It's just a mess. And then plus on top of it, my phone's ringing every five seconds, so we're trying to squeeze regular work in with vlogging, in with getting the computer set up. But, but. it'll be nice when it's done because then I can help you edit the videos. Yes, that's where our goal is. Oh. Also, I think I mentioned this the other day, I can no longer use Amazon Cloud Backup to back up all of our data, so we need to go back to a dual hard drive setup in our house because you have to have all your data in two places. And originally, I used to always buy two drives every time we would have a new hard drive, so if we bought an eight terabyte hard drive, you would actually have to buy two because whatever you stick on that drive has to be backed up to the other drive. Otherwise, you are asking for trouble and it will crash and you will lose everything. So, when Amazon came out with their Amazon Cloud and they were running a promotion that was like $5 for unlimited access, I was like, oh my gosh, this is amazing. We sold all of our hard drives, consolidated to one big drive, and we were backing up to Amazon Cloud. The problem with that was I was exceeding my allowed bandwidth usage with Comcast, which, you know, back in the day, they, were, they had a... They had an unspoken rule of 250 gigs, and 99% of their customers never went over 250 gigs. Well, now that everyone is like streaming, they upped it to one terabyte, which is a huge amount of data. No one would use one terabyte of data transfer over the internet in a month. Like, that's ridiculous. No one does it. So Comcast, or yeah, Xfinity Comcast sent me a letter saying, uh, you've been using over they said I was using like 1.3 terabytes a month consecutively for the past three months. So now we can't use Amazon Cloud Data because I would be having to pay an additional, I think, $50 a month to have unlimited every month. So now we're getting rid of Amazon Cloud Drive and we're gonna go back to the hard drive method, but because of our eight terabyte drive is so full, that's why we're going through and trying to delete stuff that we no longer need. Yeah, and now we're going to lunch. So sorry these past couple days have been really short, boring vlogs, but we are so busy right now. So hopefully we'll be able to upload something that even if it's just something small, we're still trying to get to the 
I still want to upload something every single day because if I tell myself, oh, it's okay, we didn't really do anything that day, I don't have to upload anything, then I'm going to get in the habit of thinking that's okay, and we don't want to do that. Now let's go to Around Eatery. Yeah. So, what is it called? Around Eatery Bakery Cafe or something? Eatery. This is the place, Eatery, yeah. So this is the place that I filmed the other day after going to Janice's house. We're going back again because it was so delicious. It was crazy good. Um, we love doing this. We try everything on their menu and we rate everything. And we just write did what you our favorite did things you are. The menu? No. Okay, that's fine. So, so yeah, so we'll take the menu itself and we'll start you know, with a marker and we'll mark off, we'll rate it one to five, like what we rated that it's item. It's a to-go menu. Yeah, it's a to-go menu. Take a real menu. And we did that with uh, Cubbies, we did that with Paradise Cafe. Paradise Cafe has a lot of really good stuff too. Um, but now that we've tried everything on Paradise Cafe's menu, we always get the same thing because it's the best item on their menu, which is their cranberry turkey sandwich. Turkey cranberry. Which is funny because yesterday at around I got a turkey cranberry. What? Theirs was different though. Yeah, it was I, really I good. actually, it was good. It's, it's different. It's not, it's all like healthy. It's not healthy. necessarily better, but it's Yeah. Good. And then you got the chicken buffalo, but you, uh, chicken buffalo wrap, but you didn't like it as much as mine. It was still probably a five star. Yeah. But it, it was definitely a lot better than I thought it was going to be because I love buffalo chicken stuff. But I don't usually like it in a sandwich, but I did really like it. Like a, a maybe like a wrap. spinach wrap or something. Yeah. And I think we're gonna start doing more and more photography type stuff for the vlog because um, we love it. I mean, yeah, that's what we. I mean, that's why we started this. this so we were originally gonna try to do like a photo shoot, you know, once a week, like a big photo shoot. But we might do it more than once a week. We might do, you know, a few weeks. Cause 365 when I did that, which is where you do a photo every single day, and I wanted to do like a creative photo every single day. Um, that was really hard. That was, um, I mean, it took a lot of work, but I made some of my favorite photos during that three month period. Uh, we'll film again at around. Yeah. All right, we're here. We ordered a Philly cheesesteak and a ramen. What was it? Something like a ramen? Ramen burger. Like a ramen burger. So we'll see. Okay, look at this thing. This is crazy. First of all, that egg looks really juicy. I would have had it fried more. And then yours is the Philly cheesesteak. Mm -hmm. That looks good. And these chips are freaking crazy good. Last time we came here, it was amazing. But then we just realized that we ordered off the healthy menu. And this time we ordered two things not on the healthy menu. Yeah, and it just goes to show like, you can come to one place and just order the wrong thing and, and then never come not back again. Wanna come. I mean, this has like nacho cheese all over it, like, yeah, so the like Philly, a hot dog or something. Yeah, so the Philly cheesesteak has nacho cheese. Well, if you don't like it, I'll continue to eat it. And then you can grab another one of the healthy things if you want to try something else. Thank you. Thanks. Now, this is what we're talking about. This is their tuna wrap. It's on their healthy menu. Way better. Oh, look at the bottom, how it's all nice and toasted. That looks good. Oh yeah, that's good. Nice and fresh. Like we tried these healthy things on this menu, and then if you go and tell your friend, and they come and maybe don't order something off the healthy menu, and they get something like we just tried that was gross. Not gross, but not like, I don't... Definitely not. I would never order it. Yeah, I would never order it. So that's, it's very interesting when like some people love a restaurant and other people don't love a restaurant. You should find out what they like at, at the restaurant. What are these weird things? They're like facts. Like, oh, our cuddle have names. It doesn't say they have names. No, no, but that's what they're trying to say. Great right? no. ethical standards. Ethical standards. Zone Oh, oh no. it's Lucy tomorrow, I can't wait. No, I'm just kidding. I was talking about like, you know, on that show, it's like, 
Um, how, how many hours a day do they get to roam around? <laughs> you look just like your dad when you said that. You look like, exactly. Okay. That was perfect. That was pretty good. We missed the sunset. <laughs>